School is back in session, and the Bronx community is coming together to support students in need. School season is uh, in, in full effect, uh, and we're joining together with so many local organizations to be able to serve families right here in our community. With over 1.1 million students returning to the New York City public school system this fall, many families are facing the financial challenge of preparing for the new academic year. Thanks to a trio of community-driven events, elected officials and local leaders are helping to alleviate costs and lack of resources that often hinder student success. From school supply giveaways to festivals and bazaars, local organizations, officials, and residents are coming together to ensure that every student has the tools they need to thrive. It's a back-to-school giveaway, but it's more than that. It's a community party. It all begins in Fordham Plaza, as Fordham Center for Community-Engaged Learning hosts their annual back-to-school festival. Lining up and down the avenue, hundreds of school children and their parents gather to receive donated school supplies, including backpacks, notebooks, pencils, and a little entertainment along the way. We have a lot of communities that are in need, uh, still recovering from the pandemic, uh, struggling economically, so we need to make sure we give back as much as possible so that they have everything they need uh, to start school. I have seen it being fully packed. We've had a lot of long lines, but we've had um, a lot of people coming through and getting all of our backpacks, produce. It's been it's been a great time. A lot of people. New York City Council Member Oswald Felice is one of several Bronx elected officials joining in to hand out supplies and show support. Much like the efforts of those in Belmont Playground, where a similar project is underway. <laughs> Nonprofit organization The People's Assembly holds their vibrant school supplies bazaar and giveaway where families can enjoy music, food, and games while picking up essential supplies. Event organizer Bridget Brantley explaining to BronxNet that her number one priority is seeing students succeed in the same educational system she grew up in. I am a product of this community, but I'm also a product of the public school system, and I know how important having access to resources is for our young people. The New York City Department of Education reports that 71% of Bronx students live below the poverty line, making events like this crucial for academic success. Event organizers noting that students' mental health and motivation is just as important as the materials they are receiving today. Other than the tangible and physical, you know, notebooks and bags are great, but it's a, a mindset that they need going into the world that they're going to inherit. And the support doesn't stop there. Just a few blocks away, another community-driven event is making an annual difference in the lives of local students and families of Pelham Parkway. The Pelham Parkway Neighborhood Association is also getting in on the action, hosting a school supply giveaway, distributing hundreds of backpacks filled with essential supplies. New York State Representative John Zaccaro Jr. in attendance, helping to hand out resources and provide support to families, calling this a necessary initiative to protect and empower future generations of Bronx students. So when you're talking about families who have multiple children, uh, it can get costly. And so we're providing the essentials, book bags, school supplies. Um, you know, we're connecting people with local social services um, and, and giving out snacks and things like that that kids just, you know, enjoy on a daily basis. As the borough comes together to show support of students in need, high-ranking city officials are also aware of the ongoing dilemma and taking steps to alleviate the burden. The Office of Mayor Eric Adams' administration launching an initiative last year to provide free school supplies to over 800,000 low-income families. Meanwhile, the New York City Department of Education continues to expand their aid through pushes for free school lunches and supplies. The kids are, are the future of our community, so we're doing our best to give them what they need to uh, do, the, do the best they can for the upcoming school year. It's this culmination of events happening across the borough that's showing families nobody has to be alone when it comes to supplying tools and resources for their loved one's success. From Bronx Night Community Television, I'm Chris Kimmel.